Don't press yet. Okay, good. What are you putting in there, Eric? That's a great dot right there. Gloves, yes, good. What? Oh, beautiful, beautiful, ladies. Look at that dot. Fantastic. Jane did it. Jane did it? Okay, Mitch, describe what you've done so far. Um, we have got the food, food coloring in, mm -hmm. and we just put the ice in. And have you, are you guys ready with your, the other person ready with the, with the hot water? Get ready. And Conway, try to keep your ice all the way on the, on the right there. No, no, a little bit this way. Over here. Okay. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Yes. Okay, good. Grab your paper, start making your observations. Enjoy the show. Good, Lance. Call out. Get your hot water, ladies, quickly. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Stop. Okay, get the things. Here's your guys. Enjoy the show, Conway. You have an orange chair there if you'd like, buddy. Good call out. Good call out. Okay, first 30 seconds. Oh, uh, the blue's like spilling out the bottom of the eyes. What is that called? What vocabulary word does that remind you of? How can we relate that to what we know already? What caused that red to rise? Yeah. Warm air. Warm air. What is that? That's right. And the rising warm air would be an example of what? Um, it's the air. Dude, look at my boat. No. It's, um, because the hot... It's wind? The hot... Yes. You, you're right, actually. The you remember the three that? types of heat? Whoa. This is one of them. That's right. And that is... How do we, do, how do we define convection? Um, two gases are liquid circling together. And what causes it? Um, unequal heating. Unequal heating. In which direction will convection happen? If something is heated, which direction does it go? Right, it's left, up, like down? Up, up. Right, and so then you have. Cold, it doesn't have any heat, so it would go down. But if there was another beaker right here. Okay, so you've got vertical movement. We know that. We have rising warm air, we have sinking cold air. But what else is happening? This is where I want you guys to check out the rest of it, okay? Keep watching, guys. It's not as simple as just up and down. There's a lot of things going on. Okay? That's a beautiful, beautiful example right there. It's a great wow. one, ladies. If you were to use arrows to show the direction of movement, which way would you, would you draw them? How would you draw them? Put that in your notes. Use that in your drawings. See, the silver red is going to, it's going to be like half and half. Bottom blue, up is red. The red's starting to move to the right, and this, the blue's already... They move to each other, don't they? Why is that? What causes that? That's interesting. Also, guys, it's just water. Why doesn't it mix? Why isn't it purple? That's interesting. What is it? What's up? The red is hotter, so it's rising. Yep. And the blue is like really cold, so it's going under. So what vo what vocab word are we looking at here with rising warm air? Convection. That's convection. Yeah. So if they mix, guys, what is the difference? Just the color, or what else? You guys just said it. It's not just the color difference. It's a what difference? A density caused by what? Heat. So it's a what difference? A temperature difference. Temperature difference. When will they finally mix then? When will it become purple if blue and red make purple? Oh, um, when that isn't that cold and that isn't so hot. That's right. Right now there's a definite distinction, right? Okay, keep watching guys. Good observations.